<clears throat> the uh, nurse asked me to give you this. A list of the hospital personnel and the registered visitors at the hospital. Ooh. That's a lot of names. Huh? <laughs> no kidding. Good luck. Listen, I'm going to uh, step outside and check this out. Uh, if, if you need me, I'll be down the hall, okay? Okay. If it's all right, uh, I'll stay with you for a while. Oh, all right. I mm. can have company. <laughs> I'm going to talk to your father. Oh, Daddy. Hi, sweetheart. You simply amaze me, you know that? The strength you have. Where you get it from to go through all this, I'll never know. I learned it from you. Sure. And Mama. I learned it. Oh, be quiet. Shh. Uh, oh, she just uh, walked in. Hi. Are your ears burning? Oh, well, I mean, I could leave if you want to keep talking leave. about me. Leave. <laughs> Actually, I was coming in to see if I'd get your father out of here so you could get some rest. Oh, I'm fine. No, you're not fine. I would, don't be such a hero. You need some rest. You look exhausted. Well, I could sleep for a while, I guess. Can we get you anything before we leave? No, but uh, you could answer something for me. Sure. What's that? Well, I couldn't help noticing yesterday the way that you were both dressed. I just wanted to know what was going on. I don't think we were dressed in any particular way. Oh, come on, come on. Well, actually, I, I suppose we were. Well, if you're doing what I think you're doing, then I just want to let you know that I approve. You do? Mm-hmm. I mean, that you guys have this sort of, you know, mysterious, sort of romantic game going on. I think it's neat. Can't hide anything from this one. Mm-hmm. Well, it's so wonderful to see the two of you together again, and... I just want to let you know that it's nice to see one wonderful thing come out of all this mess. I'm sorry, I, know, I just don't know how much longer it's going to be. No, no, I'm fine. Uh, how's Samantha? Great, great. I really appreciate you and Scott taking care of her like this. Yeah, please, but remember, no matter what, you got to keep your eye on her. Don't, don't let her out of your sight for even a moment. I got to go. Barkowski, what, can you tell me what time he was in the hospital last night? Well, he punches a time clock. I saw him around 8. All right, I want to see his time card. What can you tell me about Templeton? He's new. Yeah, when did he join the staff? Uh, three weeks ago. He worked in Vermont up until then. What about Schaefer? Excuse me. That looks like a bad cut. Let me take you to emergency. And the guy was the right size and the right age, and uh, seemed like he was going to fit the profile, but uh, he's only been here a few weeks, and his colleagues at Vermont think the world of him. 
So what about all the other names? Well, the ones that seemed like reasonable possibilities had solid alibis. I don't know how he found out you were in here, but uh, I don't think he's one of the names on this list. So now we're all back at the beginning. That's how it looks. The guy's turning out to be an expert at making me look like a fool. Well, while you were doing your list, I was doing one of my own. <clears throat> What's that? Well, you tell me what you think. Evan David Castillo, Richard William Castillo, Laura Castillo, Catherine Ann. Let, let, let me have a look at this. Well, I mean, you can add a couple to it if you'd like. Well, I think I will, since you have neglected to include even one of the great Latino names we could use. Oh, right. And you want to sit there and look at my father in the face when he gets that expression, when we tell him that our child's name is going to be like Filomeno or it's something? It's Filomeno. And I'll, I'll, st I'll look him right in the eye, pal. He named that kid uh, Channing Creighton. What kind of name is that to put on a oh, kid? Oh, okay. All right. We can compromise. I think we will. There's some cool names that go together pretty nicely. You got, uh, uh, you got your, uh... Guillermo Richard. Guillermo Richard. Of course, we might have to turn that into uh, Penelope Rosa. Oh. Oh, gonna be <laughs> joking. I'm trying. I know. When things get really tough, things are really frustrating. All I have to do is think about you and our baby. And I realize what's really important. And then I have something to look forward to. Our future. Yeah, that's right. Yeah. Got to keep that in front of my own mind. That's what counts. That's what's up front here. <laughs> Do you feel bad? No. <laughs> you might well, kick your old man in the face, why don't you, pal? <laughs> Too bad. 